Hello and welcome back to The Broken Doll and tonight I come with a video about changing my video, uh, my, a couple of my dolls and uh, this guy's up for to be changed. He's in his spring outfit and I bought him a nice summer outfit that was on sale at Walmart. So we are going to change him and put on this new outfit that I got for him. So let's take this off of him. I, I put this on because I took him to work and I put him in a vintage outfit. So we're going to take him. This, this is a reborn monkey, or chimp I should say. And I got him last year in the spring. I think it was around that time anyways. And him and his sister. His sister will come later with a changing too. But right now it's about him and you'll see why in a few minutes here. So we'll take that off because it was on his, he was done up at the back. They're just beautiful. These were hand painted just like most re how reborns are I mean and um, oh he's just gorgeous I, I've just enjoyed owning these little chimps and this is supposed to be like a newborn chimp now they they wear about uh, zero to three months I don't know if they're newborn he's a newborn chimp but he's pretty close to it in size but he wears a uh, zero to three months now I got him it was on sale at Walmart for five dollars this little lion outfit so we're going to put that on him I didn't think they really wore three month clothing, but yeah, they do. <laughs> and I was shocked that they really did. Um, I was trying to put him into newborn. Now some newborn, if it's big enough, uh, yeah, he can wear it. It's just iffy which ones you got to really be, you know, if it's on the bigger side, side that you can get him to wear it. But um, he, they are more comfortable in zero to three months. And um, which I kind of like because there's a little bit more choice at times that you can put on them. It's a little titch big around here, but nothing great. And we'll take off this sticker. And I'll put this on him. There we go. Over his head. Um, a lot of summer stuff is starting to go on sale already and um, you can pick up the odd thing from time to time at Walmart. I imagine stuff will go on sale even more so, but um, these were on sale there in, back in a clearance rack. So I take a look back there every now and again and you can find some pretty nifty little things back there. So just a matter of keeping an eye peel and you can find them. There we go. Oh, he's looking gorgeous. He's got his little lion, got little lion ears on him right there. There he is. Oh my word. Look at that. Isn't he gorgeous in that little lion outfit. Now we got another guy here we're going to change as well. We'll put him to the back. Now this guy's a big guy. This is Brother Coos. Now I don't know if the outfit I got him is going to work or not. He is huge. This guy is a huge guy. I know you can't see him. I'm going to get you so you can see him. You still can't see him. And that's, am I out as far as I can go? There we go. There you are. Now he is one big guy. And he's made by the Ideal Toy, Co the toy Company. And we'll, let's just let's see how long he is. I have got him back a while ago too. So I go to the top of his head. Oh, he's about 28 inches. Yeah, so he, he's a big guy. I put him in this because this is all I could find for him. I had these these uh, shorts, little short all overall short alls here for him, and that was it. I did buy him an outfit, the same as what the monkey's got on, the chimp Abu has got on. So let's change him. Um, like I said, um, I hope I bought it big enough. I'm looking at it right now, going, mm, I don't know. If not, there's always another person. I might have to just put this on him, back on him again until I find him something else. But he wears like something like. I'm going to say 12 to 18 months, if not sometimes, depending on who makes it, if it needs to be bigger. So <laughs> you really got to just um, try it out. Now he's up for restoration, too, up to be rest restored. He's got a hole in his leg here with a piece of tape going over it. But um, he needs some, some work done. But he's good right now, just the way he is. So let's get his outfit. And we'll do the same for him. So we got his shorts sitting here. I'm gonna try these shorts on. The shorts, the shirt I know will fit. It's gonna be the shorts. Oh, that just might work. Let's try this out. I'm gonna take off his sandals, don't need for that. 
sandal weather right now. I don't put socks on till winter time. Especially now that I'm retired. When I went to work I had to, but um, I, ever since I've been retired, oh, I don't want to pull too much on his legs. Oh, boy, he's got a, a chubby booby. B booby. <laughs> booty. <laughs> booty. <laughs> boy, he's big. Like, I'll show you just how hard. I can't hardly get these up his back. It's the, it's down, it's in the pants I always have the problem. He is just so wide. How a child carried this doll is beyond me. I just wonder his arms are still on. And to get his, this to cover now, his legs is just, ah, there we go. Okay, we got, see he's got tape going around his legs as well. I don't know why. Oh, because there's, oh, okay, that was not even needed to be on him. All right, let's try this out. That's not how these shorts are supposed to be. They're supposed to be a bit on the cup side, but maybe I just got them up too high. Oh, my word. Let's try pulling them down just a bit. He's a difficult doll to dress, which means back in their day, they put gowns on their babies, too. Even at this age, they had gowns on them. But anyhow, the tape on this doll is so old. Okay, we're going to go with that. We're not going to play too much with it. Let's put the shirt on him now. Take off the sticker. There's a sticker right up here. It's a two-piece set. All right. Oops. All right. I'm in there. Oh my goodness, is he ever. I think I'm more than sure the, sh the shirt's going to fit him better than the pants anyhow. But you know what? I could have went up one more size. I it just because of the pants itself. Even for the shirt, like I'm starting to see. Wow. And this is 12 to 18 months. So he could have used the 24 months in this. Again, it all just depends on what your who makes it. Oh my goodness, he's a big guy. Okay, let's try this. Now, I know it's not to his time frame and anything like that. I like to have fun with him and dress him in today's clothing just as well. But uh, there we go. He is one big baby. Wow. There we go. So now, I'm going to put my little scene together that I, I had put. I've got it all put here, ready to go. And let me put my yardstick back up. I'm trying to put things back where I find them because otherwise I can't find these later. So let me put a tea towel over and I'm going to keep talking. In the meantime, we're going to do this to you. And then when I come back, take that off, you'll see my nice little scenery all set up for you here and everything else looking just spectacular. All right. This is just for all my There we go. There we are. All right. Okay, let's take a look and see what I got here. There we are. Let me come back even more. So there we are. They've all got their line outfits on. Isn't that gorgeous? The fun you can have with dolls. The things you can do. Isn't that gorgeous? So I hope you like that one I put together there. And um, I think it's sweet. You know, them all playing with the lion and cuddling into the lion and everything else. And, you know, even if you want it to, you can as well. You can take him out, put him down beside. Just have him sitting on the edge of the table as well. Okay. And we can have that as well. Whoops, there we go. And there we are. Isn't that just gorgeous? 
Nice little picture there. Beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this. Tammy's imagination going here, going wild. Someone asked me if I was getting back into fixing up dolls again. Yes, I am. I've been preparing myself. I've actually stripped down a couple dolls. I am going to, I've been taking pictures as I go along. I don't know how I'm going to show this or if I am. I might just show you the beginning of the doll and the final results of the doll. Um, that might, might be the way I do things. Uh, but anyways, I hope you enjoyed this little video here. I think it's rather cute and um, has some pizzazz. I'm looking at ways of trying to express my dolls to everybody to show them. And sometimes a nice stuffed animal can speak volumes in there just as well. And uh, it's just not a stuffed animal. It's your dolls in with the stuffed animal as well. And I think it's just gorgeous. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, more to come. And um, I'll be back again. Thank you for joining the Broken Doll. Bye-bye.